Hey everyone, everything here with another YouTube related tutorial. Today I will show you guys where you can find your YouTube channel ID, your channel user ID and also your Google Plus username. So in my last tutorial on how you can recover a terminated YouTube account, we talked about a form that you needed to submit and for that you needed your Google Plus username and I showed you guys a method on how you can find it but apparently that method doesn't work for everyone. So um, I'm first of all I'm going to show the old method because maybe if you're watching this video this method will work for you. So you go to your Google Plus page then you open up the side panel you go to settings and you scroll down until you find third party tools and there it is your page username is blah blah blah, blah at pages.plusgoogle.com. The problem was that some people couldn't find their third party tools so they couldn't also find their Google Plus username. So that's why I'm also making this tutorial for them and it's actually pretty simple, even simpler than the method I just showed you. Here's what you have to do. First you go to your YouTube account settings page by typing in youtube.com slash account. Then on the account settings page you want to click on advanced to open up the advanced settings. And that's it. Under account information you should see everything you need. Your YouTube user ID, your YouTube channel ID and also your Google Plus username or email address. Google calls it the username, but it looks like an email address. It is just the unique identifier for your channel because one Google Plus account can have multiple channels and this username is unique to every channel. So if you have three channels, then this email address or username, whatever you call it, will be unique for every one of those channels. Anyway, that is just some extra information for those of you who were interested why you have that extra email address. This is the end of the tutorial, I hope it helped you out. I want to thank you for watching. If you liked the video, be sure to leave a like. If you disliked it, just leave a dislike. Please don't be afraid to leave a comment if you're still having problems after this tutorial. I will gladly help you out. I would also really appreciate some feedback on this video so I can make higher quality videos for you guys. Anyway, I wish you an awesome day and goodbye.